stepfathers. This is part two of uh, what not to do as a stepfather, or not yet a stepfather, in the beginning of a relationship with a woman with kids. So let's go back to where we were. Don't get pressured. <coughs> Don't allow your parents, origin family, to pressure you not to get too close to these kids because in their eyes it's a hard road they don't want you to you know do the hard path to happiness don't listen to them <coughs> and also don't listen to your significant other when she tells you oh move into step parenting don't build a relationship first back to square one so basically, the only valid suggestion when it comes to what to do at the beginning of a relationship with a mother with kids is don't rush. That is what not to do. Let's put some meat into this video. Let's put some uh, content some worthwhile info, what to do in the beginning. Take your time, play with them, don't set too many boundaries other than the logical safety and uh, <coughs> good manners. They won't disrespect you if you don't push their buttons. They won't disrespect you if you don't try to discipline them. Apart from the fact that we have to abolish the verb to discipline and substitute it with to educate or to teach. That aside, spend time with them. Spend quality time with them. Don't be on your phone when they're near you because that means your phone is more important than they are. Remember, especially when they're young, they're young, they're small, but they're not stupid. <coughs> Small kids are not stupid. They pick up a hell of a lot more than what we think they do. Go on walks. Play with them. Their games, not yours. Do what interests them. <coughs> not what interests you. It's all about them. It's not about you. You're the adult in this relationship relationship because it's you on one side and he or she on the other <clears throat> step kid I mean don't believe you're a step parent because you're not don't act like one act like mom's boyfriend play with them cuddle them if they want to if they're very small spend time with them pay attention to them that is what you need to do. Anything to build a relationship is good. Anything to build rapport, which is listen to them, especially if you are actually living in the same house, if you share the same roof. Ask them how kindergarten was. Ask them how school was. Don't talk too much. Listen. If you don't talk, they will talk. If you talk too much, they will not interrupt you and you'll get nothing out of them. You won't learn anything. What is, what is building a relationship? Building a relationship is getting to want know one another. <coughs> what is that supposed to mean? Get to know them. Get to know what they have to tell you. Get to know what their thinking is. Let them get to know you. What do all these things have in common? They take time. Back to square one. Don't rush. In the economy of a lifetime, a year is nothing. Give them time. Otherwise, they will not build 
a relationship with you if they don't build a relationship with you they have no trust in you if they don't trust you you will have no respect from them if you have no respect from them they won't listen to you you're gonna get angry because they're going to be disrespectful and then you're going to wonder oh my wife my girlfriend's kids don't respect me yeah right obviously they don't respect you would you respect somebody who came into your life and started telling you what to do like from the second day from the second week from the second month that you've met them of course not why should they because you're telling them to doesn't work that way you can earn respect but that's not respect that's fear that's I'm going to listen to this guy because I have to and the moment that I don't have to anymore and the moment that I feel I have upper hand I'm gonna mistreat him I'm going to disrespect him and then you're back at square one you're gonna have to build a relationship then and when things go south building a relationship is so much harder because you would have gotten older you have history now together not a pleasant history they've gotten older and it's a lot harder to salvage a relationship at that point than it is at square one so do everybody a favor and hold your horses get off your high horse sit down with them sit on the floor with them and treat them as equals when it comes to building a relationship i don't mean treat them as equal you know what i mean don't expect these kids to walk all over you and generally they won't and if you're not adult enough to be able to walk around and uh, find a way to build a relationship with a kid then maybe you ought to rethink your whole approach because it is possible it's a wonderful experience I've been at this over 33 years ups and downs like everything else but it's not much different than parenting in general it follows the same rules trust respect time loyalty and so on and so forth do it right from step one and you have a wonderful experience with wonderful memories to share from that moment on godspeed stepfathers enjoy don't give up and take your time cheers